Hello guys, this is JNM with the next Unreal Engine 4 tutorial and in this one I want to show you how to turn a third person character into an FPS player. So why should we do this? I mean there is this nice first person template, why not use this? Well it comes with just a weapon and arms but I want to see the whole character, ok? So I use this one and turn it into an FPS player. Let's give this a nice name like FPS, cam demo and create the project. Hey have a look at this. 4.17 preview, very interesting. Ok, here's our project, third person template and here's the guy. Select him and open the blueprint. Then I switch to the viewport and let's have a look at the setup. The camera is behind the character, ok. The first thing that I want to do is to let the camera be the child of the actor's mesh. So just drag it onto the mesh and that's it. Ok, now we can relocate it. But the problem is the head is moving and the camera isn't moving at all. But that's easy to fix, we can just use the head as a parent socket for this camera. Ok, so here is the parent socket. Select or search for the head, the head bone. Ok, great. Almost. The camera is moving according to the head's movement, which is exactly what we were going for, but the rotation and the position is wrong. So let's fix the rotation first. Select the rotation tool and rotate the camera 90 degrees. Ok, and now switch to the move tool and move it to the right till it fits the face of the character. It's a little bit hard to grab because it is moving. Ok, I think we finally got it. But before we can test it, we have to check two options. The first one is the use pawn control rotation for the camera. This is this checkbox here on the right. And after that, we have to select the third person character and check the use controller rotation yaw as well. And that's all we have to do, so switch to the editor and start the game and test our first person player. And now let's have a look. I can see my feet, my legs, my hands. Really great. Let's jump, yes. Awesome. So guys, I really hope you liked this short tip. If you do, let me know and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to JNM to be notified when new content is available. Thanks a lot for watching and see you soon.